poison them, but we've got we've got almost kind of a sweeper going on. But at least she's got she's got a good set of attacks. All right, so we're gonna put Ratata Josephine back up in the front. Um, get some experience. Ooh, hi, excellent. Oh shit! Please don't battle me. I'm about to get raped. <laughs> hey, listen, let's have a Pokemon shit. <laughs> Please, the Pokemon I caught have become a little stronger. Ready or not, here it come. Fudge monkeys. Oh, we are, we might wipe here. We legitimately might wipe. Okay, you've only got two Pokemon. Please only be level 10. Okay, no, we're good, we're fine. We got this. Um, Flame Wheel? Seriously? You jack monkey. You son of a... Is this, this is our last potion, too. <sighs> oh my god. Okay. How much damage does that do? Fudge you. Okay. How much are we doing with a quick attack? Okay, it's a two hit. That's fine. Yeah, yeah you give it your all, you freaking sideswiping... Ninja. Oh my god, don't crit. Don't crit. Don't. No! Are you serious? That's a BS! Oh, okay. Quick attack. You can't, you can't fake me out anymore. Okay. We have to switch. But that's fine. Because Oshawa will not have Pursuit. Which is the only move that can really screw us, which... We just discussed. Okay, we're good. We're good. You're level 10. Tackled. How much is that gonna do? Okay. We can take two two more tackles and we can get a vine weapon, which should two hit oh no. This is not good. Okay, so that did four? Four to six? Are we faster? We are faster. Okay. Yeah, you're in trouble. Yeah, okay, we win. Whoo! Oh my god. Oh, that was... That was very nerve-wracking. Okay, so... Apparently, I always have to assume that I'm about to be attacked before I get to the next town. Because... Yeah. Oh, thank you for your $10, Bianca. <laughs> Woohoo! You are a tough cookie, Ixalan. I'm gonna work so hard on training my Pokemon so we won't lose anymore. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye now. Bye bye. Bye bye now. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. Okay. Did we, we made it to Striaton. Where is. Please, no, don't look at me. I just. I need the Pokemon Center, like, immediately. Mr. Help! <laughs> oh. Thank you. Thank you so very much. All of the help. <laughs> For waiting, we've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Um, so let's look at our let's take a quick look here. Okay. So the reason I have it kind of set up, even though we're level 10, I'm gonna lead with Josephine. A, she has the stab tackle, um, kind of neutral to most things, unless we fight a fighting type. And B, she has the lowest hit points. So I want to I wanna try to level her up a little more. I like having my Pokemon around the same amount of hit points. That's kinda weird though. But anyways, let's let's keep going. That's my strategy. I've just learned that the more gym badges you win, the more items you can buy at a shop. That's weird. Is that is it like a Costco license? Like you gotta have the license before you can buy the things? Have you been catching Pokemon? When you have more Pokemon, you're less likely to lose in battles. And it's more fun to look at your Pokedex and PC box. Thanks. That I I gave you the wrong voice for that face. Hello, how may I help you? I would like to purchase all of the potions, please. Just, I can't buy 10 of them. That's fine, all of them, yes. Here's all of my money, please give me potions. Nope, nothing else, just just potions, we're good. All right, let's explore Striaton City. I too studied at the trainer school when I was a beginner. What the hell's a trainer school? All right, screw you, I'm going back to the beginning of town. Alright, so this was Route 2, where we caught the thing. Okay, we didn't change route somewhere that I wasn't paying attention. That's good to know. Striaton City. Let's go into this guy's house. Uh, 
I really love like the Japanese feel of the houses in the Unova region, where it's like the mats and and the tatami floors. Um, I wish there was a place where I would like take off my shoes. That's the only thing. I, I miss Japan. Anyways, I don't know why I keep going through people's trash. Oh, trainer, do you have enough Pokeballs? Don't be shy. Take this with you. Oh yeah. What? You cannot have too many Pokeballs. My advice is that when you use a better Pokeball, it's easier to catch Pokemon. I, that guy's my new best friend. I'm gonna name you uh, Bill. Bill. Hi, Bill. We're best friends now. You wanna take a picture? Look this way. Yeah. Oh. We're gonna do that. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Dude, look. Bill, you're you're a jerk. What's up, old man? The beginning of my relationship with my wife was our Pokemon battles. I could not defeat her, even though I tried many times. Uh, what? What? How'd you beat him? What'd you use? My husband and I are battle because he can't are compatible because he cannot beat me in battle. Well, so you're just you're kind of the we got a sub dom going relationship a dom sub relationship going on. Hi, traveling trainer. Your family must be talking about you right now. Um, that'd be weird. My dad lives, like, way off there, and then my mom, I don't know, whatever. I went abroad to have Pokemon battles. Are you, so you're not from here? Oh, no, I am not. I have gone abroad to have Pokemon battles. Hola, como estas? Me llamo West Brian. Uh, that was pretty good, but you don't need to say the S, you can just say me llamo Brian. Oh, you speak English. No, just that sentence and this one explaining it. Really? Okay. Here's my family guy quote of the day for you. I don't know why, but that line's been like on my head for, on my head. It's been on my tongue, in my head for days, so. There you go. That's what that guy said now. He was Spanish. After a battle, to my surprise, my Pokemon evolved and changed his appearance. I'm an idiot. I didn't know Pokemon could evolve. That's the whole point of Pokemon, though. Some evolve, and some don't. Pokemon really are mysterious creatures. Uh, this guy's kind of weird. Why are you just like at the bottom of? Have you kidnapped people? Are there upstairs? Are there people upstairs? Do we? Do I need to call somebody? Cause Fennel said she was testing something and she had a scary look on her. Ooh, Fennel, that's the person we gotta go see. All right, so this is where we gotta come back. We'll remember it. Uh, hey, what's up, bro? Some trainers train themselves and their Pokemon in the Dream Yard. You might think about going there. Could be you'll find something. This this is the Dream Yard, right? Dream Yard had a place for novice trainers. All right, we'll check that out. After we finish exploring... Striton City. That, right, that's what it is? If a Pokemon type and a move type are the same, the move's power will increase. The gym leader told me. That's good. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna check out this. What's up? No matter how often you challenge him, he always uses Pokemon that you don't like, so get different Pokemon? Like, what the hell is your problem, dude? At the site of an old factory, at a place we call the Dream Yard, there's an unusual Pokemon that can make dreams appear. Captain Kirk out. I feel like every RPG, I have to like go in all the trash things. I want to get that. How do I get that? What's, what's up, little girl? Oh, um, uh, I need an adult. I need an adult. Uh, that's that's when you run. When you say hello to someone and they just start screaming, "I need an adult." It's time to run away. There we go. Here we go. Give me this. Uh, X speed. I will not be using in battle though. That right there. That's just currency waiting to be exchanged. Um, did we look at this? We did. Three stand together. One stride. Not going that way yet. Pretty sure there are trainers. Let. Apparently, I can't go indoors. Today we learned to go indoors and check trash cans. Hey, I like your fedora. This trainer school exists to meet the demands of trainers who want to know more about Pokemon because they love them. Well, yeah, because Pokemon are awesome, dude. Pokemon have mysterious powers called abilities. Abilities have a variety of effects. And many of those effects are activated when Pokemon are in battle. Thanks. 
Hey, uh, there's a technique that lets you cancel evolution. I'll read the book about it to you. Are you ready? Uh, can you... You can read? I'm, that, that I'm more impressed. Yeah, go ahead, man. I want to hear you read. You can surprise a Pokemon and stop its evolution by pressing the B button when a Pokemon is evolving. That was... That was really good. Let's do a round of applause for this guy. He can read. Moron. <laughs> Would you like to take a quiz about status conditions? Is there money involved? Maybe. Sure, I'll take it. So here is the question. Which of the following items cures poison? Antidote? Ding, ding, ding! Right answer. Now for the next question. The item that cures paralysis is... Paral's Peel. But which of the following items wakes up a sleeping Pokemon? The Awakening? Since that's poison and that's paralysis, which you just told me, then it has to be Awakening, even if I didn't know that. Ding, ding, ding! We have a winner! Fantastic answer! Since you know so much about status conditions, I'll give you this! Full heal! Oh, that's gonna be that's gonna be useful in an emergency. Full heal does exactly what the name suggests. It heals all status conditions. What's up, bro? I like your hair, it's kinda blue. Uh, that's cool. Did you know that some moves can only be taught with TMs? TMs can be used over and over, so you might want to use them a lot. This is the best thing about the black and white generation forward. First generation Pokemon, second, third, all of them, whenever you had a TM, you had to use it. You didn't have to, but if you used it on a Pokemon, it was gone. So if you could only get a TM once, it was really hard to be able to use that move to get like good Pokemon or to like use a variety of moves that were good. In black and white, and, and the thing that the thing that they separated was they had technical machines, the TMs, which you could only use once, and the HMs, which you could use multiple times, um, and they had effects out of battle. Well, now they just made it so the HMs have effects outside of battle, the TMs don't, but both can be used multiple times, which is the greatest thing about this generation. Like, it's just the best thing. Um, I should not have clicked that. I, I know how to use all the Pokemon. We're, do we're done with this. We got this. So, poison, damage over time, um, paralysis, it cuts your speed to one-sixth, I believe. And uh, sometimes you and you get hacks where you can't. There's a 33% chance, I think. I think it's 33% that you can't act. Sleep puts you to sleep. You lose your turn. Um, there are certain moves like uh, sleep talk, which will let you use moves while you're asleep. And then eventually you'll wake up two to five turns, I want to say. Um, burn reduces your attack stat by one stage, I think. Um, and then does damage over time. And frozen is kind of like sleep except worse because i don't think it's a guaranteed wake up after five turns i think you can just stay frozen and get your shit pushed in so yeah frozen frozen is bad oh hey sharon's here um i don't know why i i tried to use my bike i do we yeah we can take sharon did we heal double check this it's a nervous i am yeah we can take sharon all right let's let's talk to sharon maybe we'll fight him what's up bro when a Pokemon is poisoned, its HP decreases while it is battling. Yeah, I just, I just read the sign too. Good job, you can read. Hey, Ixalan, have you come looking for the gym leader? No? Nothing improves your skills as a trainer like real battles. That's why challenging gym leaders is great practice. By the way, Ixalan, will you have a battle with me? I want to test how important items are in battles. Yeah. Well, let's see how effective my items are. Or maybe I should test how well I can battle without items. Hey, I just had that same discussion. The trick is items. Always items. Because items win. Anyway, this is an indoor match, so let's battle without getting too rough. That was... What? Alright. Excellent versus Sharon. You are challenged by Pokemon Trainer Sharon. Starly. Good thing. Oh, you are higher level than I was expecting you to be. I thought you were going to be just like Bianca. Okay, so we're going to go for the flame wheel, try to get the burn. Okay, we got the growl. That's fine. Flame wheel just has such a high attack power. And if we get the burn, even though it won't kill him this turn, if we get the burn, he will die. Oh, he won't die. He growled me. I forgot about that. Holy crap! Quick attack. Stab bonus. Get out of my face. <laughs> that wing attack was... Whoa. Yeah, that's th that's the word for that. That wing attack was... Whoa. 
Okay. Uh, Tepig. Okay. I think we gotta bite him. I'm really concerned. No, we're gonna potion. Because I was not prepared for this. I, I really was not expecting him to be level 12. And both of my other two Pokemon are weak to fire. So, okay. So we're gonna do 12 damage. So I can... How much is that doing? Not enough. Okay. If you burn me, I'm screwed though. I can't potion... Well, I guess I can kind of potion through you. But not for long. Oh god. Seriously? This is not good. <laughs> not good. I need your ember to miss, please. Ah, uh, this is not gonna end well for us, okay. Let's just... How much damage can we get in on a quick attack? Holy crap, you're a tank! Oh my god. This is not good for us. <laughs> we have a very good chance that we're gonna lose one of our team here. Very, very good chance. Uh, okay. Gonna put us down to four. We'll potion. That'll put us at 24. He'll put us down to 12. Oh, wait, switch to tackle. That's even worse. What a jerk face. Dude, come on. We're gonna, we're gonna, I want you to use the, your, uh, oh, and the burn? Are you serious? All right, we have got to switch. Tell me that you are part flying. Bug flying, uh. Check moves, not check moves, summary. I need to know who has the highest defense. Uh, defense 15. All right, so we have to switch to Brawly and just freaking pray he's using Tackle. Oh God. That does exactly 20. If you would just use, like, a Tackle. Just stop using Ember, please. Ah. Uh, Alright, I'm... I'm in my mind trying to decide which of my Pokémon is about to get forfeited. Because I really think one of them is gonna die, if not all of them. And I think it's gonna die... <sighs> Sadly, I think it's gonna be Josephine. And that makes me really, really sad. Oh my god. Okay. Well, yeah. It's gonna be Josephine. Because Brawly... We can't lose our starter this early. And Josephine's burned. Because we need a clean switch into Beautifry. Beautifly. Into Millie. And then I think we have... We have an okay chance. We might just wipe here. It's This might be the worst thing ever. Um, but yeah, let's... Go for an air cutter, because you can flinch off an air cutter, or you could just die off an air cutter. Oh my god! Oh, I can't believe we lost our first Pokemon. Woefully unprepared, people. This is what happens when you're woefully unprepared. Losing to you means a lot to me, or more. I don't know. It, it's not asking me to click through. It's just reading it. So learning to use items well is definitely important then. Oh, here, Ixalan. I'll give you this hidden machine. Hey, we got cut! Nice! Uh, it contains cut. Hidden machines are invaluable for exploring, but it's... You know what? I don't even want to talk to you. I'm... I'm so sad right now. <sighs> Alright. Well... Let's have a moment of silence. For Josephine. She was a careful, noble Rattata. And she will be missed.
sad face. Goodbye, Josephine.